are about to watch was once again filmed in the past, like like the other taste test video that I did. But this particular one was not filmed as far away as that one was. This one was just filmed back in August or possibly July at the earliest. So there's not as much of a difference, although I do have decidedly less facial hair. Also, I am standing a little close to the camera, so the top of my head's kind of cut off, so be aware of that. So without further ado, take it away, Past Jeffrey. Hello, everybody. So I'm filming here just because um, I've never actually filmed at this apartment before, and I don't know if this would be the best spot, but I'm just gonna try it and see what happens. To the point where I'm recording this, uh, I don't know if filming for my channel is going to continue anytime soon or not. I'm hoping that it will, uh, but we'll see what happens. But the reason that I am doing this today is because I wanted to do a uh, taste test. I did one of these earlier where, or recorded one of these earlier I should say, where I uh, tasted a couple of Pop-Tarts. Hopefully that will be uploaded at some point as well, but it's a similar concept, this whole idea of I had this thing that I wanted to try and I wanted to film it just in case I wanted to do something with that. So now that that fun and clunky exposition is out of the way, um, let's talk about what I'm here to taste. So one of the things that you uh, may not know about me, you have no real reason to, as I've never really talked about it on the channel, is that I really like biscuits and gravy. Whenever I'm at, let's say, a hotel and I have an option for breakfast and that option is biscuits and gravy, I will more than likely pick it. So, when I was at a gas station the other day and I saw these Lay's Southern Biscuits and Gravy Potato Chips, I knew that I had to buy them to taste them. Because I really like biscuits and gravy and I'd be interested to see how Lay's does. Now, I have had their cheesy garlic bread before and that was actually pretty good, so I have somewhat high hopes for these. So I'm gonna go ahead and taste them right now. Interesting smell. I'm not sure I would call that biscuits and gravy. Let's see what we got. Hmm. So I wouldn't say that these are bad. I don't know if I would call them biscuits and gravy though. I am getting a slight hint of some kind of gravy on this, but I'm not really getting biscuits, although I suppose bread chips are in no way similar, so I don't know why I was acting like that was a comparison. Mm. I don't know, again, I wouldn't call them bad, but I don't think I would have given the description of biscuits and gravy either. I will say that the more I eat them, the more I'm getting gravy, most definitely. I am tasting gravy on these. Um, I don't know if I would call them biscuits and gravy, they're mostly just the gravy that goes along with it. So again, I wouldn't call these bad. I don't think they're ones that I'm going to rush out and buy every time I see them, but they're not bad. I will definitely finish these. Um, yeah, there you go. I'm realizing now that the reason that I don't tend to do taste tests is because I'm not good at describing what I'm tasting. So it is altogether possible that you got literally nothing from this, and if you did, I apologize. But those were Lay's Southern Biscuits and Gravy. They're okay, but, you know, not the best chips I've ever had. So that's it for me. Uh, hopefully, I don't know when this is going to be up, obviously, because... But depending on when this is posted, I will probably see you at a later date.